hello welcome back to my channel today to our new subscribers karibu sana to this family and today's episode we're going to talk about radical self-love not only self-love radical self-love yes how do you show yourself some love let me know in the comment section as we continue to discuss on our topic today sorry self-love sometimes it's shown differently not only taking care of your physique not only loving your body loving your hair loving your face loving everything about your physique it is more to that self-love radical self-love you have to be willing to better yourself you have to be willing to improve yourself and one of the ways that you have to show self-love to you you have to honor your word and you have to be committed to that word if you really love yourself enough for instance maybe you want to lose weight that is very common very common you want to lose weight and you're saying 2022 it won't end without losing weight yes you have said it but are you prioritizing those things that will make you reach where you want to be you want you to be or maybe you want to lose that 10 kg are you prioritizing going to the gym are you prioritizing maybe to cut junk are you taking maybe those smoothies you have to honor and be committed to that word without that you will be on that comfort zone you'll be like ah i want to lose weight but you imagine you will never because you're not committed to do that and you know very well it's for your betterment maybe there are some clothes you know very well they don't fit you at the moment and you really 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 want them to fit you but you are still there saying i want to lose weight i want to lose weight you're not doing justice to yourself yeah you're not practicing self-love self-love sometimes it is tough self-love sometimes by the way it is tough it is not soft love get the difference sometimes life sometimes self-love it is tough and it needs commitment it really needs you to get out of your comfort zone yes out of your comfort zone and you go for it so for those maybe you want to venture into something new be a shara or maybe losing weight or something else you have to be committed yeah you have to be committed and you have to be willing to be better I believe where you are today is not where you were last year and it's not where you will be next year meaning that there is improvement and it needs effort another thing also it's listening to yourself more than listening to other people yes first listen to yourself listen to yourself first before you listen to other people also boundaries yes boundaries boundaries for example maybe you have friends that you go for party or for just have fun or maybe you have your girlfriends for you always go for shopping and you don't want them to see you like a poor person or you don't want to look poor in front of your friends yes and you don't want to tell them that you are you are on a budget so you decide to break your boundaries and maybe your financial discipline and you decide to please your friends that is not self-love you know very well this is not for me yeah you know very well you are on a budget or you know very well you are on a financial discipline system something of that sort and you break it that is not self-love self-love sometimes as i say it is tough and you have to be willing you have to be willing to put discipline in it also getting out of your comfort zone yes getting out of your comfort zone it is another thing you have to love yourself enough to get out of your comfort zone and pick or go for that thing that you wish you want or you you desire to have maybe in future or now so today i'm going to end there and uh, subscribe to my youtube channel see you next time